Coach Tom is not one to hold back. Move up, Ellen. It's the way he's been coaching for the past 40 years. It not only keeps his players on their toes, it keeps him going as well. Tomoko, that was a good return. She just did a better shot down the line. But Tom Carpenter is much more than just a coach. He's a legend. I think the shirt says it all, huh? <laughs> uh, the man, the myth, the legend. I've been very fortunate. I've been very fortunate with my health and everything, you know. And uh, it's the way it is. To say Tom's fortunate with his health is a serious understatement. This guy behind us, number 95, just tell me about that guy. Um, he is amazing. He's always inspirational. When we're like complaining about how bad our body hurts, <laughs> we're like, oh, we can't really complain because <laughs> he's been through a lot. He's 95. He still hits the ball hard. We can't even get to it sometimes. So it's just an inspiration. I hope I'm like that someday. Another shot like that, you're going to do some laps. You heard her right. <laughs> Coach Tom is 95 years old. The former president of a local welding company who grew up playing football and basketball didn't even start playing tennis until he was in his 40s. As a kid, I played a little bit, but I didn't, I didn't run any teams or anything like that. I just, you know, it's a, so it's something I can do now and something that you can do all your life. He initially picked up the game to help coach his daughter. And for the past 20 years, he's coached teams at Kailua Racquet Club, most recently taking his team, the Pacemakers, to the USTA Nationals in Arizona. The Pacemakers, yeah, because uh, he has a pacemaker. And so when we get in tough situations and on the in the tiebreakers and things like that, he always says, you got my pacemaker going again. <laughs> These days, you might say Tom has a few dozen dogs. Oh, that was good. I thought I was going to be out. It's been, it's been a lot of fun for me, and it, it uh, um, gives me a reason to get out of bed in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and who well, pushes who harder, you to them or them to you? Well, both. They're both. They're, they're, they're really good. and. Uh, uh, it's been a lot of fun, and, and it's something I can do now that, uh, you know, I, my other sports are, I'm past my prime and that was. <laughs> we, we're kind of like family now. We're always checking on him, um, buying him iPhones, teaching him how to use the iPhone, and <laughs> um, trying to keep him up to date on what's going on with the teams and stuff, because a lot of it's online. So uh, it's been fun. Turns out with all these adopted daughters, teaching has become a two-way street. He teaches them the ins and outs of the game. They teach him how to exist in the modern world, beginning with that new iPhone. <laughs> How's that going? Well, I'm not very good on that. <laughs> but uh, all, you know, all this new tangled stuff. I'm, I'm, you know, what's wrong with the telephone? <laughs> But perhaps the most important lesson of all is something we could all learn from Coach Tom. You're never too old. Yeah, I'm 95 and and I'm enjoying it and I'm playing and uh, still being fairly competitive with guys that are, you know, 20 and 30 years younger than I am. So anybody can do it. He actually said to us last year, I'm really starting to feel my age. <laughs> And so we're like, okay, well, we're in our 40s and starting to fill our age. Probably the most in shape 95 year old I've witnessed, and especially he doesn't walk with a cane or a walker or anything, and he probably never will. Yeah, um, just from watching him, he's always like, push through it, gotta keep moving, um, just keep doing what you love. And he really loves tennis, so it's been great for him to keep going, and it's definitely helped him to keep going. And I think coaching the team is also a part of a big thing that he likes to do, and we kind of keep him going with that. How long are you going to be out here? Doing this? Yeah. As long as I can walk. <laughs> Good. As long as I can walk. And I'm, I'm you know, I'm slowing down, but uh, still there. <laughs> On behalf of all of us here at 7-Eleven Hoy, 
we want to offer a huge tip of the cap to you, Coach Tom, for all that you've done over the past many decades. Continue to push your players to be the very best they can be and continue to push yourself, proving to everyone that age is no barrier if you remain engaged, active, and continue to pursue your passions. All the best to you, Coach Tom. You are a legend.